Hello, my name is David. I'm managing coffee program and assisting product management at Aeron's Coffee. Now I'm at our new space and we are preparing our showroom and cafe for the public on March 1st. The address is on the screen now. Today I'm going to review about this Varia coffee maker. So this coffee maker is a multi-purpose coffee maker that you can do five different brewing methods. So I'm going to go through each method to how to assemble each parts and how to brew coffee with Varia Coffee Maker. The first brewing method is pour over and put this bottom layer to the main vessel. And then put this dripper on top of the vessel. And Varia Coffee Maker comes with paper filter. And this paper filter is same size as Haria O2 size. So take a paper filter and put it on the top. So the main vessel uh, capacity is 550 grams of water. So I recommend to use uh, up to 27 grams of ground coffee for a pour over. The second brewing method is mocha pot. You need four pieces, so filter basket, top screen, bottom vessel for mocha pot, and the main vessel. So put 12 grams of coffee in the filter basket, and then put the top lid, make sure to uh, close all the gaps, and then put this uh, filter basket and top lid to the bottom vessel. The bottom vessel has safety valve, and you can put 270 grams of water in the bottom vessel. So put the coffee in, and then make sure to seal the bottom vessel to the main vessel. Then you're ready to use. So bottom vessel doesn't have handle to hold safely, so I recommend to start from warm water, not from the hot water. So you're ready to make a mocha pot. With 270 grams of brewing water, you will get around 180 grams of coffee output. The next brewing method is French press. You need main vessel, blank bottom unit, and French press screen. So put the blank screen to the bottom of the main vessel. And main vessel can hold around uh, 550 grams of water. So I recommend to use up to 27 grams of ground coffee. Put the ground coffee in here, pour 550 grams of water, and then wait for four minutes, and then uh, press down the French press filter. This French press filter has double screen, so you will get a lower amount of sediments when you get the French press coffee. Next brewing method is cold brew and tea infusion. For those two purposes, you can use either blank basket or mocha pot bottom unit. With the mocha pot bottom unit, you can make um, bigger scale and with the blank bottom layer, you can make smaller scale of cold brew and tea infusion. So put the mocha pot bottom unit to the main vessel. And then this fire maker can hold around 800 grams of water. So for cold brew and tea infusion, I recommend to put your coffee or tea leaves between these two filters. So put the coffee in here. Now attach to the top screen. And push down the filter unit. Then filter unit will be located in the middle of the main vessel so you can uh, infuse tea or cold brew coffee as long as you want. Thanks for watching today and we upload our video contents every Thursday. Please leave a comment or video request under here. And until next time, happy brewing.